Hi guys, Apple Newbie here and welcome back to my part 2 of episode 3 of season 2 of The Walking Dead. Oh my god, that's a bunch of words to talk in one sentence. Anyway, so episode 3 is titled In Harm's Way. So basically what we're gonna do this warehouse, will I help Sarah or do I think I'll do my own work? Cause in a way, I don't know, oh man. If this is reality, I'll do my own work. She's not a baby anymore. We should all grow up, right? I don't know. You should? Should you? Shoulda, woulda, coulda? <laughs> I know, I'll do my own, oh, man. But I'm feeling guilty, but not helping her out. Do your own work, do your own work. <sighs> but I'll get in trouble if I'll not do... Oh, sorry, Sarah. I'll do my own work then. I'm sorry. As much as I wanted to help you out, it's just that I don't want to be in trouble. Trouble, trouble. Oh my God, she's she's done nothing. Oh, oh shit. Oh, oh no. Oh no. What? What did you do? These are only half done. Are those live branches? Clementine, I asked you to help her. Just checking in. <laughs> See how the new girls are working out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Reggie. Yeah, Bell. Hey. What the fuck happened in here? Look, Bell, they're new, and me with my arm, it's just not the easy... I just have... I have one arm. Shut up, so shut up. Shut the fuck up. Uh-oh. You better have an explanation for this. And I mean now. Okay. Bill, please, just... Sounds just... like you were about to give me an excuse when I asked for an explanation. It was my fault. Yep. No, oh, this ain't your fault. We talked about this, Reggie. Didn't we? Oh, my God. But you just don't get it, do you? Get what? I... I... Why don't you girls wait outside? Reggie and I have a few things to talk about. Oh my god, Reggie's in trouble because of me. Oh god, dang it. I should have helped. Thanks for the help, girls. Or if I did help Sarah and and Clementine's side is not yet done too, so What's I wrong, guess Sarah? we're all in trouble too, right? I don't know. Oh, can I do a rewind like Life is Strange? Rewind. That's a thing about rewind, man. Are you okay? <gasps> oh God, 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 I God, God, no, God! No, no, please, Bill, no! Oh no, no! no. Oh my! No, no please! Ah! What? The... Weakness, incompetence. It puts us all at risk, and it won't be tolerated. You think about that the next time you're asked to do something. Can I push you now, Carver? Too. Get downstairs. Bonnie's got some stuff for you to do. Go! What the F U D G E? Oh my god, Carver. Long way down. Achievement unlock. I should have not. Oh, taken. hey. So, they want you to run some supplies out to the guys working at the expansion? Real simple. Just take this over to them. That I jacket looks real nice. I don't know what Tavia's talking about. What's wrong? It. Clem? You alright? Reggie. Reggie's dead. What? What are you talking about? Carver killed him. He pushed him off the roof. Maybe... Maybe it was just an accident. Oh my god. You don't need to defend him. I was there, Bonnie. Listen to me. Take this stuff out to those guys and come straight back. Just be safe, okay? Now ain't the time to be calling attention to yourself. I need to go find out what happened. No. Please don't defend Carver. Hey, Troy! Clem's just gonna take them boys some nails. All right. Go on. Can I just shoot nail guns to all the people here? I mean, Carver only. Oh my god. Hey! That ain't your concern. Get that stuff over to them boys. Just follow them cables. Oh, you got a... Okay. Where should we be going? 
Oh, huh. Are you sure these are strong enough for me? Yeah. I ain't nobody's laborer. Fuck that. Let them do this shit themselves if it's so goddamn important. Get your fucking Denny? hands off me. You ain't gonna force Denny? me to do this bullshit. Denny? I said get your hands off me. Or what? You gonna go tail on me? I'm trying to help you, asshole. Yeah, this is a real help. Why don't you just worry about yourself? Reggie's dead. Carver killed him. What? You sure? Who did you? <laughs> Shit! Fucking crap! Oh my god. Oh, I don't have a weapon. Oh, there it is. Come on, Clem. No, no. Oh, come on. Come on, one, one knockout. Oh, oh, do you think I need to hide? Oh, my God. Old A to escape. A, 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 I'm holding A. Oh, you... I was holding A, man. Game. Telltale. 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 God dang it. Not again. Why do I always die on season two, man? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Again, again, again. Shit! Fucking grab something! Hey, come on. I wasn't pressing A earlier, man. Guys. Stop it, zombers. A one, two, three, four. No, four. Come on. Come on, let's go, let's go. Come on. I'm, I'm holding A. Hey, hey. What's. Oh, what the. I was holding A. What should I. Oh, man. Are you gotta be kidding me? What's wrong with that? Shit! Fucking grab something! Come on, third time is a charm. We can make this. I was holding E. But the thing is, there's something I don't know, man. Oh, on. Come on. I don't like it anymore. Come on, come on, come on. I'm holding A, I'm holding A to escape. Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Not again! Maybe you can hear it, but I was so. Oh. Man, this is so frustrating. Game like this is so freaking frustrating. You don't even know what to do anymore. This game, it says holding A. Come on. Oh my god, I'm sorry about that. Didn't mean to. I minimize the game, that's why. Let's skip for a while. Come on, man. Come on, let's go. Left, 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 left. I'm holding A, I'm holding A. Hey, hey. What? Oh. I give up. I definitely give up. Is wrong with it. Oh, come on, man. I know. Oh, I'm gonna rage quit. Honestly, you gotta be kidding me. Hit it, Clem. Not one, twice, thrice. I was. It was. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, I'm holding A, 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 I'm holding A. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. This walker really knows how to do or something. Come on, what to do, what to do. I'm already in the... Oh, the QQ time. I freaking hate it. And he... Oh, God. Thank God. Finish that freaking. Ah, oh, at last it's a saving point. Get that hammer. Oh my god, it's freaking heavy. Why did I pick it? Uh oh. I got nothing now. I got nothing. Uh oh. 
Where's Kenny and Mike when I needed them most, man? Oh, I think I'm gonna die. I got a feeling. Oh, the QQQ time! And... Q. Come on! Q. Oh my god, this is so freaking... This is so freaking... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh... My Get up. hands! Get out of there, come on! Make me save your ass. Jesus. Oh my god, thank you, Troy, even though you're so like that. Thank you. Oh, thank god, you're okay. All right, enough mushy shit. You get back inside right fucking now. I'm sure they got shit for you to do in there. Now! Think I'm fucking around? Now I gotta sit down here and babysit you assholes. Can't do a simple fucking patch job without me here cracking the whip? Oh, man. Not again! Don't wanna. What? Come on, run. Who's that? Oh, you. Oh, no, it's the girl. Ah, oh, no, it's oh, Lucas. Stop. Hey, it's me. It's Luke. Luke. Yes. Man, bit the hell out of me. Think you drew blood. Come all this way. This is, this is the welcome I get. Aww. I was worried. We all were. That was good to see you too, kid. All right, listen, we ain't got much time. Okay, I followed y'all here best I could. I haven't had a night's rest since y'all got nabbed. And, well, that's the first chance I got to talk to somebody. <laughs> They're everywhere, okay? They got guards watching everything. Shh, shh. Oh my god, Luke. Lucas in Minecraft. There's a herd of lurkers just Sorry, south of us. It's bigger than I ever seen around these parts. Carver mentioned that. Said he hopes it passes us. I heard folks talking about that, but that ain't so. Okay, it's gonna hit this place. I know it is. Now, I don't know when, but it's coming, and it's gonna be soon. See, I've been looking for places to, to get you all free, but I haven't been able to find anything yet. Are you feeling okay? No. No, I mean, uh, yeah, yes. Sorry. I, I just could use some sleep, you know? Hard to rest when you think a lurker's about to get the jump on you at any, any moment. But yeah, <laughs> yeah, I'm fine, okay? Don't worry about me. It seems dangerous. Well, the whole situation's dangerous, but, well, we're in it now. That's what we got. We just, we just need a plan. You know, a way to get you and, and everyone. Uh-oh, someone's coming. Luke! Oh, sorry, sorry, shit. Okay, Troy ain't gonna like you being late. Listen, Clem, I need you to meet me here tomorrow about this time. Because I, I need you to get me one of those radios, okay? Do you think you can do that? Just, just one of those walkie-talkies. I just need to be able to tell y'all what's going on with them guards. You know, I'll figure out the schedule the patrols are on. I mean, they're they're all over the place, but I can keep an eye on them for y'all from out here. Look, we ain't gonna be able to shoot our way out of here, so we gotta be careful. Where do I get one? I think they keep them in the stock room. I ain't completely sure, though. Just keep your eyes out for the charging station. Now, they put most of them back on there at night. Remember, you meet me here tomorrow. I'll try and be here around this time, but if I ain't, just wait as long as you can, because I really need one of those radios. And just let everybody know I'm all right, okay? I'm worried they, uh... Get out where I can see you. Uh-oh. Come on. Go on. Get out of here. Bye, Luke. Hope you're okay. Keep safe and get some rest. The hell were you doing? Huh? I was hiding from walkers. Don't go in there, you hear me? That is off fucking limits to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bill Radio Troy. wants a word with you up in his office. So get on up there, now. Bill Carver want me up there? Why? Why do you want me? Why did he summon me? Oh! That's why I... Dude, you better go up and see Bill. He doesn't like to wait. Ooh. So, you should probably go. Okay. I know your backstory, boy. You lost at the... Uh oh why is Rebecca crying? Rebecca! Why are you crying? Oh, She's no. a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. 
I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Now get in here. What do you want from me, Carver? <gasps> oh, you got to be effing... Calvin. Calvin. He passed out hours ago. He can't hear nothing. No point in making a racket. You're a bully. Come again. You're just a bully. I know it wasn't a fair fight. Yeah, it was. Yeah, I suppose it wasn't. But life ain't fair most of the time. I wouldn't be so concerned about his well-being if I were you. Not with you being so close to the fire yourself. I definitely now. like you. What you want me to do? You make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are. And you won't end up over in that chair. Now, you might not believe this after what happened earlier, but I liked Reggie. No, you he didn't. He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. It's easy to let depression sink in during times like this. But he was weak. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will. And weak of character. Yeah. And we can't have that around here. Not anymore. Yeah, but he didn't... Not with yep. what we got at stake. He didn't deserve that. Even if he messed up, he didn't deserve to die. Yep. Oh, he certainly did. No, he didn't. Who are you, You see, God? Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. Do you understand? No. Well, I wish it was different, I do. But they are weak, and we are strong. That's why it's yep. our responsibility to shepherd the flock, to keep them safe. No. It's their nature to That's follow, why I don't understand not you. to lead. Because we're not the same thinking. I'm not like you. Exactly, Glam. I know it when I see it. And we're more alike than you think. No, we're not. In fact, I think you realize it, but you're not comfortable with it yet. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized it back in that cabin. You were scared. But you looked me straight in the eye. Kept your nerve. That's what we need. If we're gonna get through this, the next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you, raised the right way. The way my child will be raised. It ain't this herd that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. It's not knowing. If I got anyone to hand all this off to. But I ain't worried about that anymore. I'm gonna make it's you mad. It's not your baby. It's Alvin's. Well, even if that was true, it's mine now. All right, now. Bill, you there? Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Troy really knocked the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at when he can. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. Okay. One long day. Heard I come. Zombie home. Cause we all know what happened this morning. I don't know what that son of a bitch is gonna do next. So you wanna ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up? How is that better? Cause this place will be fucking chaos when that thing hits. No one will be paying any attention to us. And that's when we go. It's our opening. We just gotta figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do it. What is it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. You know that's not what he's saying, but it does sound dangerous. This shit is all dangerous! Kenny! Do not speak to me like that. Maybe Luke could help us. He's outside. He wants a radio to help keep an eye on the guards. Thank you. That's the plan I vote for. You know about Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. If Luke can tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good time to escape. That seems reasonable. Who knows when that'll be? There was a girl back at Crawford that used church bells to send walkers all over the city. We just need something really loud. The PA oh, yeah. system Carver is always using is quite loud. 
There's some speakers outside the building, pointed toward the parking lot. I saw them when we were walking out to the work. Troy's always standing next to one of them. I saw the controls. They're in Carver's office. She's right. It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. We just gotta get into his office. Why didn't you say something sooner? Because it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And it's still stupid. The sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. You're real difficult to deal with sometimes. Penny. No, that's all right. You ain't exactly a peach either. We should get the radio to Luke. It doesn't hurt to have more information. I agree. Fine, fine. We can do that. But the herd is still what's going to get us out of here. Maybe Luke can tell us where it's hitting from. Okay, so we get that turd radio, he keeps us posted on the herd's movement. We fire up the PA thing and bring the walkers to roll over this place. And then what? Get some guns and shoot our way out. I don't know. Whatever we can. We improvise. Then that's not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. I figured out what your problem is. You don't think this stuff through. If the end of the plan is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Actually... I do it all the time. Okay. Hi there. First words I ever hear you say, and it's just some crazy, stupid shit. Hush. What do you mean exactly? When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell you from one of them. Now I don't know who's crazier. Yep, trust me. I've walked before. through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. I've done it too. What? It's how we got out of the Marsh House. Lee covered me, and we walked right through. Really? Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. All right, what are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. We still have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that, too. Mm-hmm. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. Okay. Hey, yeah, you'll be my best friend Where now. Where the hell did she come from? Now you're talking. We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then, just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so you probably won't fall to your death. Great. That thing breaks all the time. Unless something's changed, it won't support much weight. Come uh -oh. on. Up and at him. Don't push her, Kenny. She's our best bet. I mean that, Clem. Now or never, I guess. That's my girl. Yep. We gotta get that rope and down. And I got a feeling Mike, we will not you die. you wanna boost her up? Come on, kid. Or else, if we die, click to continue. Don't let go. <laughs> I got you. Hi, Clem. I got you. Anyway, guys, I think this is it for my part two of episode three of Walking Dead season two. Thanks again for watching and for sticking around. And I do hope we can get a grip on this one <laughs> on the next part. Thanks again. As always, take care and take it easy. Bye-bye.